Today we are learning all about life on a farm and as part of a living, breathing history lesson. Yeah, Joe is live in McMinnville to tell us more about Farm Fest. Joe, I have a question for you. For people who go to check this yep. out, how um, involved do they get to be? Are they mostly going to be watching displays or do they get to get pretty hands-on out there? Yeah. No, you're, you're mostly watching. It is a, a <laughs> these are trained uh, professionals. Wayne Beck, with how long have you been uh, driving a mule team here? I, I'm well, years I've had mules for 39 years. It's, it's not something you can just pick up and do. So, but it is really fascinating to see it in person. Now there are interactive areas. There's a whole museum here if you've never been, where you can kind of learn all about the history of uh, farming in our area and agriculture in Oregon. And the big highlight of Farm Fest is the plowing demonstrations. Now earlier we had Dwayne with his draft horses. And Wayne, you love your mules. Now, what is it about the mules that you enjoy so much, do you think? Well, I think uh, the personalities. Mm -hmm. Mules have a real personality. They really, uh, they, they love to have affection. You know, if you treat them well, they treat you well. Uh, they work hard for you, like Dwayne was saying. They will, they have stamina. And now, a, a uh, mule is, what, their mom was a horse, their dad was a donkey, right? Yeah. And it's, it's always how it is, you know, it's not the other way if around. If you switch it around yeah. and you do it the opposite, it's called the hinny. Okay, all right, but mules obviously but much mules more the, Yeah, and common. they're sterile, so you don't have, you can't take two mules and get another mule. You have to have a horse uh, and a donkey. Gotcha, each one is a one-of-a-kind design there. Okay, so we showed Dwayne with the draft horses. Are these guys different? Because I noticed with Dwayne, there's all almost kind of like just they're pulling you along do these guys is it the same thing or no well well let's see let's go for it let's go let's all right. follow you here all right so i'll just talk to him a little bit yep. tufa carola and just like that 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 sound they, that means they know that means go they know that means go and when they heard us talking they thought maybe we wanted to stop <laughs> there you go <laughs> Yeah. So. And, and that's it. Now, mules, I mean, how long can a mule go? Because, I mean, in the old days, they'd be plowing all day, I imagine. Right? Yeah. Well, these guys are not in real good shape yet because we haven't done much this spring. But if they were in shape, they would go all day. Absolutely. And uh, they have good stamina. That's why they use them on places like, you know, uh, the Death Valley 20 mule team and all that stuff is because they have that stamina. They are fascinating animals. Wayne, thank you for sharing them with us today. It's so cool to see. And again, Farm Fest is this Saturday. It's right here at the Yamhill Valley Heritage Center in McMinnville. We'll have more information at kptv.com. All right, don't tell Dwayne I said this. I think the mules won today. All right? <laughs> That's you yeah, don't say that at all. <laughs> all right. It's yes. an ongoing competition. <laughs> That'll wrap it up for now. Don't tell Dwayne Van Dyke I said that. Back in the studio. <laughs> uh, what a great education for everyone. Really.